Hey what is up everyone so we have a big news today all the way from Korea stating that Samsung is working on an M1 chip competitor that will be made in collaboration with AMD. According to Economic Daily Exynos 2200 will hopefully debut later this year in a Samsung laptop and after that it will make its way to Samsung smartphones and tablets which means soon we will be able to see a huge jump in performance on Samsung devices. This will be Samsung's answer to Apple's M1 chip which was announced back in November 2020 for Max. But in Apple's latest spring event, they also added this chipset to their iPad Pros, which means we may see this type of performance soon in iPhones as well that can hurt Samsung sales. That is the reason Samsung is working on this chipset to fight against serious competition offered by Apple. And after its debut in Samsung laptops, hopefully the chipset will make its way to Samsung tablets and smartphones later next year in 2022. This chipset will have an AMD GPU built on 5 nanometer process just like the Apple's M1 chip, but it will provide desktop class graphics on portable devices. AMD is kinda ahead in graphical performance so it will give a tough competition to Apple's M1 integrated GPU. Only time will tell how better the performance is as of now we don't have any clue regarding the benchmarks. But here I'm concerned about one specific thing, what will happen with Qualcomm chipsets which are offered by Samsung in certain regions. If Samsung only thinks to provide Exynos 2200, only in some regions it will once again create a chipset debacle. I hope Samsung is working on it as well and we may see about the same device across every region and country. Samsung laptop with Exynos 2200 chipset is expected to come in June of 2021. But that was the news for today, I'm also so much excited for this chipset since I have heard about Samsung and AMD collaboration 2 years back. What do you think about it? Let me know in the comment section below. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, bye bye.